JAG stands for Jobs for America's Graduates. So we take high school students that don't know what they want to do in the future and help them whether they want to go into college, trade school, or just jump right into a career. We really just do a lot of leadership stuff and like preparing for the future, like your jobs, what you're doing after high school, college. Recently went to national. Yeah. What was that like? Where did you guys go? Oh my goodness, we went to Dallas, Texas. It was an awesome opportunity that we got to do and we competed in four events overall. One of the ones that we placed in was business plan. So you have a business plan and you present it to a panel of judges. It was Shark Tank, we went up. Sam did a great job of going around, showing our products, being like, here's what it is, walking around, keeping the judges involved. And we did a great job feeding off each other and talking and persuading the judges. Sam, what is your guys' product? Uh, so we have this machine called a Glowforge, which allows us to laser engrave, cut, uh, and score products. So I felt like we were going to win it. It was definitely nerve-wracking to be the last ones called. It left a little bit of suspense of like, oh my goodness, what if we didn't? But I turned around, talked to Sam a little bit. I was like, man, if we don't win this, the whole trip was for nothing. But we ended up winning and took, took home some hardware. Sam, have you guys, has Jack ever won anything like this before, you guys? Uh, I believe this is our first, first place at uh, Nationals. So we were really excited for it. Uh, I think our go-to saying for us was, if you ain't your first, you're last. Ricky Bobby. Bobby. We also did the service project. So we raised over $500 for our community. So we got a recommendation on that. What was your guys' We were competing in the creative decision making and we placed top 10 in nationals. We were given a problem and we had 30 minutes to prep for it. And then we had eight minutes to pre uh, present it in a different room to a panel of judges. It was very nerve-wracking for me. I was thrown into this kind of last minute. They had competed at state for it. We all got our turns talking, and I think we presented very well. What uh, was going through your mind when they said you guys got top 10? Um, it was pretty exciting. Like Bella said, we did get called last, but when that popped up, it was just like, wow, we really didn't make it. Just all of the hard work that we put in into every co competition in general, just, it's really rewarding to hear your name get called up on stage in front of everybody. It's taken a lot away a lot of confidence, a lot of um, self-improvement. This was really a piece of cake when it came to actually presenting, because it's always been there. We've already had a business for a long time, so it was easy to present on it, because it's something we're passionate about.